Peace be upon you. In this video, we present a scientific miracle of the Holy Quran, the fertilization of the clouds. In 1946, the American chemist and meteorologist Vincent Joseph Schaefer, born 1906, died 1993, developed cloud seeding. The concept of cloud seeding is based on cloud condensation nuclei, CCNs, which are small particles of 0.2 micrometers present in air. CCNs are responsible for the condensation of water vapor, the transition from a vapor to a liquid. The amount of CCNs in the air is about 100 to 1000 particles per cubic centimeters. As the wind blows, air and its content of airborne water particles and CNNs are swept away. Due to the wind, the air rises and cools, and because it cannot hold all of the water, clouds are formed. As water vapor condenses into larger and heavier droplets of water, precipitation forms in the clouds and rain falls. Similar to the man's sperm, which is required to fertilize the woman's egg, CCNs are required to fertilize the clouds and are brought on by the wind. Therefore, this process can be simply described as fertilization of the clouds by the wind. Allah Almighty mentioned this action between wind and clouds in the Holy Quran more than 1,400 years ago. Chapter 15, verse 22, And we send the winds fertilizing, then send down water from the clouds so we give it to you to drink of, nor is it you who store it up. In the Arabic version of this verse, the word used for fertilizing means to impregnate or fecundate. This description by the Quran verse is absolutely accurate and agrees entirely with modern earth science. Thank you for watching this video.